This is the Peruvian Pacific Ocean, stretching 200 nautical miles out to sea along the Peruvian coastline. With between 1,800 and 1,900 species of birds, more species than any other country, except for Colombia, which has roughly the same number, Peru is a sheer paradise for the bird watcher community. When it comes to pelagic birds, many of the species that can be seen in Peru are virtually impossible to find elsewhere. Birding trip provider, Colibri Expeditions, is based in Lima, Peru's capital city, which is the perfect access point to many fantastic birding areas of Peru. Gunnar Engblom, experienced birder and general director of Colibri Expeditions, has recorded 90 species of pelagic birds here in Peru, 40 of which are regularly seen on his Lima coastline bird watching trips. Well, most of the people that come out on these trips, they will always get some new birds, yeah, so uh, birds they haven't seen before. And we can pretty much guarantee that they will see several species of storm petrels, waved albatross we see all year round. It means that they can see a waved albatross without going to Galapagos, that's pretty good. And uh, a lot of other birds as well. Yeah. And uh, most of the times we see uh, some cetaceans as well. Usually um, the three species of uh, dolphins we see regularly, the common dusky and uh, bottlenose dolphin. And on every third, fourth trip we see whales. Many birds fly down from the Galapagos Islands to feed on the rich abundance of plankton and fish to be found in the Peruvian waters. The birds used to be important economically speaking because they produce large amounts of guano, a key ingredient of many types of fertilizers. Peru is home to some 120 native bird species as well as 127 types of hummingbird, three quetzal species, cock of the rocks, umbrella birds, condors, and the famous macaw licks of the Amazon rainforest. And if you want to see Humboldt current birds, Lima's coastline is the place for you. Gunnar Engblom affirms that Markham storm petrels, hornby storm petrels, Peruvian diving petrels, white vented storm petrels, Inca terns, red-legged cormorants, and waved albatross are but a few of the birds common to these waters. Well, these birds are indication of uh, rich, rich wealth of nutrients, the storm petrels especially. And when we go out to say 20, 30, 30 nautical miles and we see good numbers of, uh, of, of storm petrels, five to six species, that's a good indication that, we, that it's uh, very, very rich waters out there. And these are completely different birds that we would find close to the coast. Yeah? So for, for a bird watcher it makes a lot of sense going out further out. Yeah? And not only one time, the bir one birder cannot uh, uh, hope to see all the birds in Peru in just one trip. They, have, they will have to come back in the different regions in Peru. And the, and the pelagic birding is just one of the many facets of uh, bird watching in Peru. And, and a very good one with the humble current here being very rich uh, with lots of different species that you can't find anywhere else. As you can see, Peru is a country that will fascinate any bird watcher, both amateur and experienced. Get booking that flight and come and experience it for yourself.